Hey, what's up everyone? This is Rob with Blame Rob Videos, and tonight I'm going to be playing Diablo 3, beating King Leoric, the first boss of Act 1, on Inferno difficulty. And actually, uh, I've done this already before. I have a video up already, but uh, someone posted a comment and asked to see my equipment that I was using, and I thought that was a good idea. So I'm going to be beating him again, just for you guys. Uh, really quick, I threw up my skills on the screen. You can see them uh, on the skill menu. I have Hungering Arrow, Elemental Arrow, Elemental Arrow, I always mess that up, I don't know why, I mess up saying that, I don't know why. Caltrops, Mark for Death, Smokescreen, and Sentry. Uh, for this fight, I'm probably not going to be using Sentry that much, I'll probably be using Smokescreen the most uh, to avoid his teleport attack. As for my items, I'll hover over my uh, equipment really quick just so you can see it. To be honest, I'm not using a lot of high-end gear, uh, I don't think you really need high-end gear for this fight especially if you're a demon hunter. As you'll see, a lot of my gear is under level 60. I'm not farming, I'm not exploiting, I'm not playing the auction house or anything. It's uh, just basic gear. I'll throw up the details too so you can see. But it's just really basic gear. Some of it, I guess, is pretty high dex, pretty high vitality, but really it's not that great. And actually, when I did the video, I think I was using an 800 DPS bow. Uh, since then, I've gotten a new bow, so that's about it. Uh, this, pri this fight is pretty straightforward. Uh, if you're wondering how to beat Leoric, I'll show you how. Um, it's All you do is basically kite him, and then when he does his teleport attack, you use your smoke screen to avoid the damage. And then if you run out of discipline, uh, you can use a potion. Uh, if you're having trouble in the sense that you're running out of discipline, you can also, I think you can use, I'm pretty sure you can use vault instead of smoke screen, but that's not confirmed. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure I used Vault on normal difficulty and it worked just fine. So if Smokescreen doesn't work, I'm sure Vault will work. Uh, the only reason I'm keeping the skills I'm keeping is because I don't want to lose my Nephilim Valor. Uh, oh, in addition, you can also, uh, you, instead of using the Sentry, because I'm not going to use the Sentry. Instead of using Sentry or Mark for Death, you could use Preparation and that should work too. So that way you don't run out of uh, discipline. But really, this is just a kiting game, and since you're a demon hunter, you just fight at range. The only attack that is of any threat to it all is uh, Leoric teleport move. And so he should be using it here. He kind of follows a pattern, and so as soon as you see him start projecting his image towards you, all you do is start using your smoke screen. That's it, and you run away. And you try to you want to try to keep Leoric in view so that you can always see when he's going to use his uh, teleport attack. He usually alternates between between summons and uh, that teleport move. And if you ever lose him on your screen, what you want to do is start looking at your mini map, and you'll be able to find him again. And so, see, he's used teleport twice in a row. He usually teleports twice. Sometimes, I think, as you lower his uh, as you lower his life, he'll start using it three times in a row. But for the most part, it's uh, two teleports, and then you're safe for a while. And so here, I'm actually gonna. Uh, Oh! I usually don't get hit, that's really bad. Anyway, it's pretty straightforward fight. I'm gonna move up here so he teleports. So you can guide where he'll go, because he's always gonna teleport on you, so you always want to move away from those skeletons. I didn't do a very good job. Uh, ah! Oh, uh, that was a premature teleport. I hope I don't suffer because of it, but whatever. Oh, and I'm lagging. Oh, almost got hit. So I hope I don't die. But in addition to smoke screen, you have um, potions at your disposal, and uh, Caltrops is also not bad to reduce damage, but really you shouldn't just use it. Really just be using uh, smoke screen. So he should teleport now, it's been a while. And there it is, there's his teleport. Oh, kill that guy. Oh, nice! My, uh, what's the, what's the face actually did something. So he should teleport now, it's been a while, and there it is. Also, if you're a demon hunter, sometimes you'll get lucky and you'll avoid the uh, attack because uh, you have really high dodge. That always helps. But for the most part, pretty much how it goes. Oh, you really want to avoid that whirlwind attack? I'm pretty sure it one-shots anyone. Uh, I don't know how much damage it does because I've never been hit by it, but I'm pretty. It one-shot uh, a barb in my party. Just be careful of that whirlwind attack. You really don't want to get hit by it. So anyway, that's uh, Act 1 Inferno, King Leoric Boss, uh, Diablo 3. Um, 
Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you hope uh, the tips were helpful. It's pretty straight. Like I said, it's pretty straightforward. Just use smoke screen, and you'll be fine. So again, this is Rob with Blame Rob Videos. Uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.